Hello, this is Magnus Kullberg from Burton Scandinavia. Today I will show you Benito 57. It's called Yours Truly and it was built in 2006. It is currently located at Vindö Marin, which is a service yard located approximately one hour north of Göteborg and Landvetter Airport for those of you that want to travel and look at it with a plane. This boat had a full refit in 2018. It was put back in the water in 2018 for a short test of all the new systems that was installed and upgraded and serviced and it was only sailed for a few weeks then it came back into the yard and it has been resting in this yard since then. Here you just could see the new windlass anchor chain and anchor also the bowsprit for the Genaker which is new. It's a new teak deck, windows, port lights, skylights are also new. This boat comes with conventional mast, with lazy jacks and with two forestays. Here is a closer look to the port lights and the teak deck. And here you see the winches. It's uh, six winches altogether. Four of them is electric. And here is a view of the huge aft deck with great storage and with a folding bath ladder platform. All the instruments and VHF, the electronics, was replaced in 2016. And it's Raymarine. This model of Benito 57 has the steering in the center of the cockpit, whereas other models have the steering wheel here under the spray hood. Also the windscreen is new, the spray hood and the bimini. The cover of the steering wheel is also new. And a newly varnished copy table. So that's a look of the boat from the outside, now it's time to take a look on the inside. Here is the inside, 
Directly to starboard is the navigation and to port is the galley. Big saloon with two sofas. Walking a little bit forward, there is two identical guest cabins with double berth. There is drawers under the bed and quite big cupboard or wardrobe at the foot end of the bed. Both guest cabin has separate heads cabin. And here is a brand new electric toilet. There is also a shower cabin, which is used by both guest cabins. It's a shared shower cabin. Here we're looking again towards the back. At the head end of the berth, you can see the air condition control. All the cabins has air condition. And we take a look in the port guest cabin. During the refit, all the floorboards was revarnished, and a lot of touch up was made with the interior. Here is a view for the shower cabin seen from the other side. You see the nice hull windows, a skylight for ventilation. The upholstery is leather and it looks like new. And here is a view of the navigation area with a plotter and sailing instruments and VHF. The saloon table can be folded up and you can easily sit six to eight people around. The galley is really huge. It's almost like my galley at home. Here you will find a double sink, a drink water tap with a filter. It's a lot of storage for food and cutleries and, and so. The stove is new. You see here the fridge box and the dry storage.
walking further back. We first come to a day heads. And here is a manual toilet. The electrical panel. And here is the engine room. Onan generator is original and had a full service by the yard. Battery chargers and inverter and so on is also new from the refit. As well as the engine. It has approximately 25 hours running time. Walking one step further back, we come to uh, another guest cabin with two bunk berth cupboard here to the back of the boat it's made for uh, fitting a washing machine which this boat don't have instead it has a uh, big space for storage Here we enter the owner's cabin in the back. It has a really wide and long bed. A lot of storage for clothes and everything that you want to bring. Has its own uh, heads. Also here with a new electric toilet. And a separate cabin for shower. So this was a look on the inside of this Beneteau 57 and if you are interested in this boat, if you have any questions or if you are interested in uh, coming to look at it, you are of course welcome to contact us anytime at Burton Scandinavia. I am happy that you have looked at this movie and uh, wish you a good day. Bye bye.